It seems like Marvel just doesn't make them like they used to anymore. Am I right or am I right? Here we have a coming age series about a teen learning about her newly acquired superpowers. This is a character that doesn't shy away from who they are and I like that about her. You got some spunk in you girl. This character is Kamala Khan who is a Pakistani American girl living in New Jersey who's the Avengers biggest fan especially and obviously for Captain Marvel of course. She develops her own powers and learns how to balance them with the faith and her family. The show focuses on her teen life as well as her hero life. I do like how Kamala is out of touch with her parents but wants to be a good daughter to them however she knows that the traditional path isn't what she wants she wants to forge her own way it's tough as she has the desire to be a superhero but at the same time she wants to be loyal to her family pakistanian culture and muslim heritage so i like that aspect of the show and plus the center focus on family connection and legacy i for one like the diversity so with that said i enjoy the representation for pakistani culture muslim religion and its community i also like the character kamala khan she's quirky has nice energy and over-the-top imagination and is likable overall she reminds me a lot of Haley Steinfeld's character in Hawkeye. The show has some form of personality to it. I like the editing and animation integrated into the environment within the show along with the transitions. It really does add to the visual style of the series. The show does have like a Disney Nickelodeon teenage feel to it with a touch of Spider-Man Homecoming in the mix of it all. Alright, let's get to the meat and potatoes. So listen up here boys and girls. First episode started off decent with some nice energy and I liked it but that is the pinnacle of the show unfortunately. After the first episode the show loses some momentum and just plateaus leaving the show to be just bland. The stakes were weak in my opinion, I didn't feel like we were working ourselves up to something big or important. There didn't seem like there was much to lose and I was never worried for the character Kamala. And I think that's one of the major things here that's hurting me with this show. From the first two episodes, the show sets itself up as becoming a superhero story, but then later pulls away from that and focuses more on family history while the becoming superhero aspect of it all is in the background. And that sort of threw me off a bit as I was even questioning myself, where are we going with this and how are we going to tie this all in at the end? Especially since we haven't established a major main villain. Episode 5 felt a little off. I wasn't a fan of the pacing and it felt slow especially since it was the second to last episode of the show and not much had happened at this point. The episode didn't have the same editing approach or energy as the other episodes and the finale was pretty underwhelming. The so called big moment at the end of episode 6 with her powers didn't hit me the way it did for many. The show was just alright, nothing special about it and nothing bad. Overall just a basic show. Show. Although the series did feel like a history lesson though. I'm just saying.